Hello guys, what's up? This is Starkiel here. We're back for some more Life is Strange. You guys ready? Okay, let's go. Okay, we're back here. What we do? Report needed or hide the truth? You know what? You know what? You know what, guys? You know? You know? You know what I'm going to do? No? Me either. So, square. Yeah, I, I knew I just what I was saw doing. Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott. You sure? Yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, Not slow crazy. down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know. I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family and oh, one of Blackwell's most honored students. Of course. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. So what happened next? Then... then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you gonna bust him? This is... serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told we'll you, we'll continue this discussion. What he can do in my office. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. There's nothing. Of course, this academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now. Uh. Should I rewind and change my story? No. No, fuck that. No, no. Like I'm. You did the right thing. I read. I did the right thing. Yeah, yeah. I did the right thing. Tell the authorities about what the fuck happened when the guy has a gun like crazy. Fuck yeah. I did the right thing. Right? Oh, but everybody looks so chill outside. Like, damn! No fire alarm, nobody's panicking, everybody's just chill. See? That's what you do, man! Uh, missing person! There's too many of them! Oh, everywhere! It's like trash! Look at her face, she's like, oh my god, trash. Anyways. Uh. Miss Grant sure is dedicated to that petition. Hi, Miss Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition. But would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? Sure. Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. David Madsen doesn't need another excuse to harass students here. Max, this isn't about personalities. This is about protecting civil rights and our school's legacy of freedom. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage, from the Native Americans who founded this land to the pioneers who shared it in peace, not fear and violence. Uh, Native Americans? Um, yeah. The Native Americans? The tribes who were here first. Who welcomed the settlers? Hmm. Both cultures found a mutual symbiosis and thrived. Now, before I assign you homework with this lecture, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? What's wrong with 1984? Uh, uh, yeah. Absolutely. I don't mind security, but not pure surveillance. I knew you were my favorite new student at Blackwell for a good reason. This action will have consequences. Well, yeah, I mean, I think, oh. Mm. No! Mm. 
Now you know what? Not having I, I, also here's the thing that's gonna happen. Not having cameras will make it hard for me to solve something later. But having cameras will help me out, but still the resolution is going to be the same. I assume. So well anyway, let's go with this. I just yeah. Yeah, let's go with this. For now. Hey Jugger! Hey Jugger! What? I'm also a ghost? What? He just passed through me, man! What the fuck? Besides time traveling, I'm also a ghost? Damn. Oh, there you thank you. I was like, do, do you blink? Yeah, she does, she does blink. I, I just... They look weird. They look kinda weird. Hello. Hi. Look. There's Hayden in his Vortex Club harem. He sure is living the dream. Really? Mm. Hey, Hayden. There she is. The retro selfie master. That's me, all right. You look relaxed as usual, Hayden. It's a skill one cultivates at Blackwell. Especially when one represents the Vortex Club. Not to boast. Do you really want Nathan Prescott to represent? Oh, please. Nathan is like everybody's voodoo doll. Kill the rich kid. He's alright and a fun guy to hang with. Fuck the haters. Because of this? Most likely. Uh. He seems genuinely unstable to me. Nate has his extreme moments, but don't we all? I don't know yet, Hayden. Mm. What the hell is the Vortex Club anyway? It seems so elitist. Only if you're not cool enough to get in. And it doesn't hurt your resume. If you say so. I do. But you should actually come hang with us one night. Then you wouldn't be so inclined to gossip. You mean hang with the Vortex Club? That sounds like a setup to a horrible prank. Chillax, paranoia girl. Chillax! <laughs> desperate for fun. We know how to do that on our own. It seems weird to think about partying with all those Rachel Amber posters up. You're high. Rachel used to hang out with us too. She was a blast. Smart. Yeah, she's not high. Like, you know. <laughs> uh, yeah, the present. Do I press that? Everyone want me to press it? Okay, let me press it. So you knew Rachel Amber. Oh wait, I mean, no. She liked the party. <laughs> Fun to be around. I oh, thought I was talking yeah, about the other girl. She was hot. Yeah. Oh, with that Victoria. I thought I was talking about like oh, like Victoria, you know, being bitchy. Uh, Did Victoria like Rachel? She seems like the jealous type. Don't think you know Victoria so well. She respected Rachel, you know, even if she didn't act like it. Hmm. What do you think happened to her? Um, uh, whatever happens to people who disappear without a trace. They get kidnapped, kill, suicide. Uh, so, 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 um, I mean, aliens. Um, escape home. World killed. Um, I don't know, man. There's too many options. Rachel was actually a member of the Vortex Club. No, Rachel was like her own club. She was actually too cool for us, oh. and I'll deny I ever said that. I'm more confused than before. It's such a mystery. Let's talk later, Hayden. That it is, Max. Now I have to get my chemical on and study. We should get you and Dana out one night. Did he just offer me weed? What's the f what's, what's like? Why the girls are on the floor? Just like why? Anyways, um, uh, Brooke. Brooke actually has a drone. Uh, I don't see it. Oh, it actually looks kind of cool. Uh, to take a picture. Sucks. I ha oh shit! Zoom in. No! Zoom out! I don't want to zoom in! Uh, 
That's the thing that, like, good thing this game doesn't have photo mode. If it had photo mode, I will be all over that shit. Uh, yeah, I, I take too many photos in photo mode. Why? I don't know. Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? Uh, is it legal? <laughs> is this legal? Is that really yours? Is that even legal? Yeah. Of course. Nobody knows about it yet. Isn't it considered a weapon of war? Uh, you read too many conspiracy sites. This might be too complicated for you. Funny, Warren said you were smart. Please, step back. Hey, 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 Jugger, don't go through me. Oh, okay, now you push me. Okay, okay. Cool, cool, cool. cool. This day has been so insane. Oh. Everything is happening too fast. Hmm. And none of it makes any sense. These visions, this power. I keep expecting to wake up one more time. But if this is a dream, then I'm not asleep. Which means somehow I did rewind time. Yeah. So there has to be a reason. And I have to find out why. Well, you don't have to. I mean, you could just enjoy the power. Right? <laughs> Squirrel! Hey, little buddy! Hey! I cannot get to you. Damn invisible wall. Damn it, invisible wall, squirrel. Okay, look. Stella always looks so serious and dedicated. Good for her. Hey there, Stella. Hey, I know you. You're the new quiet girl in Jefferson's class. Isn't he incredible? No, uh, I think so. I think so. We're lucky to have such a famous teacher. And I actually love his work. Me too. His New York urban stuff is great, but I'm glad he came back to his Oregon roots. Screw the East Coast elite. It must piss off those pretentious galleries that Mark <laughs> Jefferson is teaching photography to us Blackwell Hicks. Plus, he is pretty hot for an older guy. Aww. If Victoria wasn't all over him, I would definitely make a move. I knew it! I knew it! She, she, was, she was there, you know? I knew it! I knew it! <laughs> Now that you mention it. Now that you mention it, he doesn't respond to Victoria's flirting. <laughs> yes, of course. That means he has good taste. You have a lot to learn here at Blackwell. Rachel Amber absolutely had sex with him. Well, I heard that from a good source. Huh. So, you knew Rachel? Not really. I saw her hanging with the other cool kids like Victoria. Not my kind of clique. But I heard insane stories about Rachel. Damn. And I just so seeing the guy poster, he's like the guy over there. Well, I mean, the guy's not responding to Victoria because he will get in a lot of trouble. That's one. Two I don't know. I don't know about I'd you. like to study this photo if you don't mind. What photo? You're talking to her. Uh, photo. Oh! For now. Oh! Hey! Well, hold it! What? Too fast! Hold it! I cannot read that fast! Oh, thank you. <laughs> uh, <laughs> like, you said, like, you hold it! Like, wait a minute! Uh. Yeah. Better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Is that Bruce Willis? That's so cool that Blackwell is doing a show of Mr. Jefferson's work.
there's Justin and his skater posse. They're so cute doing their tricks. Okay. Yo, Justin. Check out the Max. Come to Thrash? Thrash? You mean stage diving or? You're such a poser. If you can't even name a simple nose slide or a trade flip, you should walk on. Yo, Justin. Uh, check out the max. Uh, I can't do snow slide. No slide. But I'd love to see somebody do a tree flip. Oh, sick. You're not a poser. Nah, I just can't skate worth shit. Aw, oh, check it. We're gonna destroy some rails for you. What do you want to see? Uh, that that tree flip. Let's go, go tree flip. Tree flip. Let's get Trevor all over that action. You can't do it? Oh, oh yeah! There it goes, Trip Flip! Trevor, you got Trip Flip! <laughs> you got Trip Flip! Yeah, I like that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're fine now. Yeah, that, but still, that must have hurt. Uh, speak. Hey, I'm stoked to see those photos framed and shit. You're not really a skate Betty though. Hmm, not really. <laughs> not really. Too bad. It's nice to have the females on board too. Rachel, Amber, and her punk friends love skating with us. Oh. Who was Rachel's punk friend? I can't remember her name. She was hot. Tats, blue hair, hardcore. She stopped hanging out with us after Rachel disappeared. I ran away. Mm. You knew Rachel? She used to chill with us sometimes. But one day she just vanished. I hope she's living the dream somewhere. If anybody hurt her will get a skate posse and take them out with her boards. You ever hang out with Victoria? Fuck that. I'd rather rollerblade than hang out with snobs like her. Let's chill later, Justin. Anytime you want to take some action shots, we're here for you, Max. Cool, bro. Mm, bicycle. Uh, okay, so, so far it's about figuring out what happened to Rachel. Hmm. Okay, I have a run button. Yay! Look. Now I have to go back to the dorm. This day never ends. I'm sure this poster has stopped millions of bullies. <laughs> yeah, there. Poster, swimming pool. And this is where the otters perform their aquatic magic. Otter power? I'm so not there. They sure get a lot of mileage out of otter power. Another. Ooh, graffiti! Look. Oh, that's not nice. Poor little otter. Oh, it's, oh, 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 it's an otter. I thought it was, I don't know, a rat, dog, or something else. Ew, gross. At least switch to e -cig. It's the same! It's still bad for you, whichever you pick. Like, don't, don't smoke. I mean, it's a really hard habit to get rid of. Everybody I know that has uh, the smokes, they, everybody says, I'm going to quit. They never do. Never do. Hey, wait! Aren't you the same girl that's over there? And over there? And over there? But with different, you know, clothing? Or do all blondes look the same in this game? Uh... I 
think his name is Evan. He always looks so intense. Photo album. Wait, which is photo album? Hey, Evan. Mind if I check out your cool portfolio? Let's see if you're worthy of it, Max. You'll have to answer a simple question. Who photographed the famous falling soldier? Gotta be Eugene Smith. Well, they both were famous war photographer images. But you should know the difference. Good try. Wrong answer. Okay. Yeah. What? Evan's portfolio always looks so uber pro. I'd love to see his photos in there. Wait, if it's uber pro, that means it draw. It's a portfolio that drives on the taxi. Because it's uber. No, no joke. Okay. Hey, Evan. Let's see if you're worthy of it. Uh, Robert. Dewey. Isn't it Robert Dorno? Oh my. You can't even tell the difference between street photography and photojournalism. No portfolio peak for you. Oh, come on. Dude, you're, you're, you're an ass. I just wanted to say that. Hey, Evan. Yeah, 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 yeah. Steve McCurry? Uh, Steve McCurry? Unless he could travel back in time. McCurry was born five years after the falling soldier picture. McCurry also shoots in color. In other words, no portfolio. In other words, another try. In other words, I'm going to be you with a first hey, try. Let's see. Robert Kappa. Robert Kappa, of course. I love his work, despite the controversy about that photo. My, my. This quiet child knows things. That's why I'm here. You're a kindred spirit, Max. Would you care for a perusal of my portfolio? It's not a privilege I grant to many. I'd be honest. Oh my god, such a bunch of assholes. <laughs> There's too many! These photos are great. And Rachel Amber's face is mesmerizing. Huh. Okay, Rachel. Uh -huh. Okay. Oh, pretty cool camera though. I have to admit that. I mean, the camera looks okay. Pretty good. Um. Dormitory is that way, but I'm going to go here a little bit more. Clever. Uh, sucks. Uh, yeah. Uh, hello? Max, I don't feel like talking. What's wrong? Nathan Prescott, little rich bitch kid. He thinks he can own people like his parents own Blackwell. Like he owns the Vortex Club. Yes, he's a nasty piece of work. You, you know him. Um, that kind of uh, bust him. Should that be a good thing to say to another person besides the principal? Not really. Not really. I've seen him around. Sounds like you know way more than that, Max. Tell me. Well, for Coley, man, you first didn't want to talk about anything. Now you want information? That's gonna cost you, man. You know. Uh, he's just a dick. Nope, he's just an entitled dick with a lot of money. Not my type. Somebody needs to take that prick down. Yeah. He'll take himself down. Yeah. Yeah, history always proves that, right? Just wait for justice, you sheeple. Hmm. I mean, it, it will eventually happen, so... Um, who else can I talk to? Daniel! Daniel is always drawing something. He makes me look like an extrovert. What's up, Daniel? Oh, hi, Max. Could I, um, ask you a question? Would you mind letting me sketch you? I do put my sketches on Facebook, though. If his rooms are good, I don't see why not, so... I'd be honored, Daniel makes me feel like a muse. Funny you should say that. I was just thinking about my real muse. Rachel Amber. Hmm. 
<laughs> start like you know fuck her start drawing her like come on you know <laughs> uh okay you knew her you knew her no but once she asked me to draw her portrait oh she was a natural mm. hard to avoid her posters all over campus yeah kills me to see her sweet face used as a crime photo uh, she had a good heart I'm hearing too many different things about her. Like, there's no real identity of her yet. Like, there's still something. There's so something missing. What happened to her? There's gotta be a story. She just stopped coming to class. Some people said she ran away. Some say she jumped off a cliff. I just hope she's okay. Mm. Okay. Why don't you start drawing me? Even though I must be a step down from Rachel. Yeah. No way. You're a good substitute. <sighs> you know what, dude? That's not a way to say that to any oh, girl. That's a good posture. Oh man. Yeah. She does look cute doing that pose. So cannot deny that. Good. Good. Don't not say good, good, man. That's so scrippy. Don't say good, good. <laughs> Best portrait ever. That's pretty good. You know, that's 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 something. If if you're going to doing um when you're doing draw when you're drawing somebody else, it's a good choice just to be simple, not to do too not to try to do that many details, especially if you're not a good no, realistic. I don't want to go there. Why not? I kind of wish I could have gone to a school like that. That's kind of cool. That's one of his famous shots. I love how it captures the moment. Mm. That's it? I thought that picture was also having like I don't know something. Like, like, like. <coughs> oh, sorry guys. Ah, sorry. Um, yeah. Go to dormitory. Is it, that's the shortcut. Yeah, invisible. Wall. Yeah, shortcut. Yeah, I don't know why girls have to run like this. Like, I don't know. I'm a guy, but still, I don't think girls should be running like that. I don't know. Maybe there's an actual reason for it. I have sister. I never asked them. But I, they... I need to go to my room and return Warren. I never see them run. <laughs> I mean, they're they're older than me, so I never see them run. So. The Prescott Dormitory. Good lord, Nathan's family owns my dorm. You just figure that out. How long have you been there, girl? Uh, you got head in the balls? Did that just... Did that just happen? Nice throw. Hey, Logan Robertson. All-American asshole. No, bro. You can't take a picture. You gotta wait till Friday's game. Bro! No, bro! Not doing another picture, bro! Zachary always looks like he'd rather be throwing back a beer than a football. Nice! Nice, bro! Football, Max. Big football. Step, Step away, away, man! <laughs> oh, God. Glad to see our campus is eco-friendly. Wait, now? Just because you have a trash can means they're eco-friendly? Hmm. Interesting. There's Kate, looking sadder than usual. I don't think that's that she looks sad. I just think she looks tired as hell and pale. Hi, Kate. Hey, Max. Uh, how was class? How did you like class today? I don't remember. I guess I don't care about much of anything today. Is there anything, Max? I'd like to be alone if you don't mind. Nice. Girl. I'm sorry. Girl, you're depressed, right? Seriously, Max. I don't want to talk. Hmm. Good old Samuel. Some people are creeped out by him. 
He's not creepy, just X-Files weird. Mm -hmm. Isn't that the same thing? Howdy, Samuel. Well, hello there. Oh, no, definitely creepy. <laughs> uh. What's up with these Rachel Amber posters? Yeah, definitely creepy. But only she would know that, right? Uh, I guess. Oh, it just you know makes that, the campus right? look sad. You can't color over that sunlight. Really? Holy crap, his voice, man. And that face? Damn! Nice, bro. You knew Rachel? How can you know a prism? You just stare in awe. Mm. Now I have to go paint windows. What? Dude. What? What was she like? She must have been popular. Even sunlight can cast shadows. Rachel did both at once, you know. She was like a battery. Positive and negative. Sweet. What do you think happened to her? Best not to dwell on the past. Samuel looks forward. Like a clock. See you later, Samuel. And watch your step around here, Max. After I sweep, I paint. Serial, serial killer in the making. Holy crap, this guy's Ricky. What the? F what? Awesome. Uh, Splinker? You'd think with all the rain here in Oregon, you wouldn't need to water the lawn. Imagine. I guess Blackwell has to keep the lawn and plants well manicured to look good on a catalog. Of course, I mean, you know. Glad to see our campus is eco-friendly. Yeah, we're love flies. I feel like Alyssa and I should be better friends. Hmm. I don't know. Oh. Hi, Max. What are you reading? Yeah. What are you reading? Love today or die forever. Don't even say yeah. anything. It's a bestseller. What to say? Yeah. Good point. Now, if you'll excuse me. Yeah. Sorry. I really have to find out what happens. You sound all weird. I will leave you by yourself. I hope you don't mind. Oh, this is kind of cool. The shadows actually are. They look like paint, like drawn. I mean, they look like baked. Okay, I mean, it makes sense because they're, they're not casting actual shadow. Huh. No. Interesting. Hmm. I mean, this this thing does have like interesting. Don't thing. take it out on the tree, loser. Rachel owns me money. Pay it up, bitch. Yeah. Poor tree. Okay, girls, get the fuck out of the way. Oh shit, there's Victoria and her mean girls. Um. Oh look, it's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. Selfie hoe, is that something? What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. The Daguerrean processor. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh, don't worry, there's... Oh, wait. Hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh, yes, Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. Do you understand English? Get lost. Look, there's enough space for me to walk past you guys. Seriously, I mean, your backs are there. There's enough space here. And this girl just didn't look that mean compared to you. But, I mean, I could just still step on her, her, you know, hand and she will, you know, move, move away or something, you know. Okay. So, rainbow sprinkler look. Okay, now where exactly is the sprinkler valve? 
I was, um... Okay, now where exactly is the sprinkler valve? Should be... Oh! Hmm. Hmm. Okay, bro! <laughs> could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones incentive to beat it. I could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones incentive to beat it. Yeah, but I think that will cause something more. That thing will get this guy scared, the painting will fall, and there's going to be some messy stuff happening. Mm -hmm. Damn, I missed something. I better rewind. Sweet. Hmm. You missed something. None shall pass. Capiche? Hmm. Okay. Awesome. So if I'm here. This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. Okay, okay. Stop it. What the hell? Are you kidding? Look at this. Jill, Victoria, it's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look... Great. I can't even chill on the steps. Yeah, stop chillaxing. Nice, bro. Nice, bro. Oh, dude. I can't grab that. Samuel is way too. Hmm. A paint bucket next to Victoria. I see a plan. Nah, that should be too evil. She looks like a pissed off wet cat, and she's still stylish. Do you understand English? Get lost. Let's see if this works. What the hell? Are you kidding? Okay, sorry about that, guys. Uh, we're just gonna... we hope to time it if this episode soon. <coughs> no way! No fucking you okay, way! Victoria? Oh, Sam, okay. we're sorry. Wet paint is not good for hair, nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. <laughs> uh, you should take a picture. You should. Oh, man. She looks so sad and lonely sitting there alone. Mm. Uh... Hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? Just trying to be friendly. See? Make fun of. Come for. Uh. Hmm. You know, I'm not a bad guy, so. <laughs> I am sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was. But there will be another. Yeah. Okay. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. Dude. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. Nice, bro! Nice, bro. <laughs> you deserve a better shot. <laughs> Sorry about blocking you and, and the go fuck your selfie. Face, so it was good to be that friendly. That was mean, but pretty funny. Just 
One of those days, you know? I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. I'll see you later. Au revoir. Well, guys, that's it for today's episode. Thank you for watching. Victoria probably played oh. me. I should have played her. Better get to my room before I find Warren. Well, I mean, you did play her, so yeah. I still, I mean, l listen. I mean, you can be nice with anybody uh, to some extent. But, anyways, thank you for watching, guys. And hope uh, to see you next time. Peace.